Oh, how's it going, guys? Well, is there? Yeah, it's an acorn tree right above it, honey. So, rebuilt these triads. Uh, the factory insert on these things, they come in two sizes, and this one was the factory in outsert for these triads were 97 grains. And every single time I was shooting them, compared to these Maxima Reds, I was having a three inch drop just at 20 yards. And obviously the, the larger, the further the distance, the larger the drop. I got my kid out here calling crow. She's doing it. She don't even know what she's doing, but she's doing it. <clears throat> so this morning I had to rebuild these. Uh, took a lighter to the front end. About a minute, two minutes per tip. Uh, held it about an... <sighs> held it about half an inch from the end of the carbon. And uh, allowed that heat transfer to just go in, loosen and soften up the glue. And after about a minute or two, just grab a pair of pliers, pull them right off. Uh, I had a cup of water right next to me, just dropped them right in there. Um, so, shopping around, found these uh, Easton's. They're 50 grain tips or inserts. And on the inserts themselves, they got like little, it looks like a club with little dashes on it. And, I mean, I'm no genius. Common sense tells me that each little dash indicates about a 10 grain amount. Because there was only four of them. Something like that. Whatever it is, I don't know. I just know that these, these inserts now are a lot less than um, 50 grain. So, these triads, extra small diameter, are supposed to be weighing less than these Maxima Reds at a standard diameter. And because of almost a 80 to 90 grain difference on the front end, I was getting a drastic drop even at 20 yards. So, now we're gonna try them. And we're gonna see what this does. We're gonna see if my lovely wife can hold this phone Well, I shoot him. And you were the target. Hi, Liam. Both? <laughs> no. Just, just me for now, I guess. And we're at 28 yards. Is that hitting high? No idea. Hey, baby. Huh? You want to come here and help me? Mm -mm. Trinity, stop. You help me, baby. Come stand behind me real quick, okay? Hey. Trinity, come here. You stand over here? Oh no! I'll be in there in a minute. What are you doing, baby?
Just a second. Hey, come here, sweetheart. Come help me. Come help me. Thank you, honey. Come here, baby. So let's see what these did. I have no idea why my reds are shooting high now. Terrible grouping, but now you can see the difference. At 28 yards, I was hitting center, so I don't know why these three, unless I bumped my sight or something, but either way, I'm happy with them. And they're in there. What happened? What happened, baby? I stuck. I got You gonna help? Oh, you are such a big help. What you got in your hair, kid? More bugs? Hey, can I have that? Hey, hey, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Young lady? Trinity? You little butthole. So, yep. So, time to sight these in, which they seem pretty good. <laughs> what in the heck was that, kid? Oh my gosh. So, yep. I'd say these are flying a lot better now. No. no. Uh-oh, she says, stop. Don't go. So these are shooting a lot better now. Um, which, thankfully enough, because I only got like eight more of these carbon, the Maxima Reds left. And, uh, you know, I didn't spend this. I didn't spend the money on these arrows for no reason. So, yep, 28 yards. These are closer to the target than what my reds were, and I don't know why. I'm thinking the, the only difference is because I had these tips on the reds before. Mm. That might be it. Even though they're both 100 grain tips, they're shaped differently. So, don't know why. Don't know why. But, yep, so that's it. Not as nearly as a as much of a difference as prior, that's for sure. But uh, yep, yeah, I'm gonna keep playing with them. But I think uh, I think they're done, and we're ready to calibrate this side in for these arrows. So hope this was uh, somewhat helpful. I know. Between my kid and the crow call and probably a lot of me babbling but um yeah it was really bothering me spent all these monies on these arrows and for them to just drop that much within 20 yards it was uh yeah you know i didn't like it because i like shooting long distances too i stand at the top of my driveway 72 yards and i hit my targets you know and Right now, at 65 pounds on a 27-inch draw, that sight maxes out at, like, 93 yards. <clears throat> These being heavier, I mean, that sight would probably only go down to 70 yards at best after calibrating it prior to rebuilding these front ends. So, oh, well, you guys, I'm going to continue to throw a couple more, get my practice in today, and... Um, yeah, hope this video helps you guys out. So, talk to you later.